Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to Pause and Effect Quick Play. I'm your host CJ and today I am playing the demo for Divine Dynamo Flame Frit by Inti Creates. Now, uh, considering Inti Creates' name is attached to this, I am very curious to see what this game is about because they've had some hits and they've had a lot of misses in my opinion. Like, uh, Umbra Claw was a bit of a misnomer for me, but, uh, as well as card and seal, but I'm very curious to see how this goes. Okay, so tutorial. Press the... Okay, to swing your sword. Let's try out a three-hit combo first. Okay, it's B. Huh. You can charge up power by holding the B button. Burn stuff to a crisp with a charge slash. Interesting. Press the LB button if you want to roll. It won't take any damage. Radio, off to a world of adventure we go. That's it? Yuto Hino. Up until now, I was just your average middle schooler. Oh my god, it's Isekai. <laughs> I got summoned as a dynamo knight to save the world of Hologuard. <laughs> Flame for the divine dynamo. <laughs> Find the four Dynamo Knights, and you're one of them. Yeah! Robar Castle. Man, it was such a pain getting here. <laughs> Didn't see any people in town either, just endless monsters. I wonder what this game was about. It's very, like, Zelda-esque and very similar to, uh, the older East games. Like, I'm getting vibes of, like, memories of Kelketa, Ark of, Ark of Nepishtim, East Origin, games like that, you know? Okay, I got that. Got a key. Ooh, handy. This really does feel like an old school top down Zelda adventure. You know what? I see nothing wrong with that. Out of magic power. Ooh. I'll take that, thank you. I guess I found my ally. <laughs> there, this is no situation to be laughing in. I just see, <laughs> talk about coincidences, huh? Spirit wand, huh? Wind Sylph. Ah, so she's Wind Element. It ain't easy being someone's childhood friend, bruh. That's good. Check the 
checkpoint, I'm guessing. I can cut the grass and find stuff inside. Yep, very much Zelda. And I'm not saying that like it's a bad thing. I guess if I have, like, one gripe, it's that the uh, sound effects are over voice acted, which is a recurring problem with a lot of uh, NT Creates' other stuff. But you know what, compared to some of their other projects, I don't mind it nearly as much because I actually really like this. Maybe that's a bad thing, I don't know. Okay. I wish I had a map, but I don't. Ooh, triple kill. Getting pretty close to dying here. I need a heal stat. Seems like the enemies don't respawn, so I have that saving grace at least. Ah, oh, there's a keyhole. Of course there is. He's probably in this castle. Uh-oh. Please don't let the enemies have respawned. Oh, good. Good, good, good. It's almost better to, to move in this game using a D-pad as opposed to a control stick. Movements feel more precise doing that, is what I'm trying to say. I forgot the keyhole was over there. Well, at least I got some health out of it.
Interesting. Guess there's really nothing to gain from going this way, but that's fine. Well, other than health. Now that I've realized I can spam magic power to burn grass, that makes this game a hell of a lot more funnier than it has any right to be. Let's see what this does. Will it destroy that one? Okay, that was hilarious. Here it goes. is silly. But you know what? I like silly. Yeah. Oh, I don't get grass this time. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. All I had to do was just bait him into charging. Yeah. 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 Not bad, not bad. Just keep following the trail. <laughs> God, why is that so funny? And of course, I missed a key. All right, all right. I'll go back. I need like a. I need like a dungeon map or something. Map to like select or options or minus or whatever that button is on an Xbox controller. I don't know what it's called. I just know that right now hella backtracking is involved. Oh, I didn't go that way. You are. Nice. Let me guess, go up these stairs and that's where the key's at? Oh, nope. Oops. Okay, time for more backtracking. I gotta say, too, this song is actually kind of catchy. Gotta wonder what some of the other songs in this game sound like. It 
this is making me like tap my fingers and my feet. The rest of the soundtrack can't be that bad. Ooh, checkpoint. Ah. <laughs> Who listens in when someone's talking out loud to themselves? Oh, you had to rhyme it. You're like a dude to a flame. Who writes this stuff? Ah, <laughs> uh, here goes. What? It's cheating time. Alda Flame Thurs. Burn bright, flame frit. Loud and clear. What's about to happen? Excuse me? This is boss battles? First and foremost, move the cursor to your target and fire at it twice. Where is it? Use LB to guard on your left and RB to guard on the right. So it's like a differing variation of um, punch out. You can attack with your sword while press by pressing the attack button while guarding. Hmm. Depending on the circumstances, bosses can be knocked down when attacked with your sword, or even parried with your guard. Stay strong and find the optimal way to engage them. This really does evoke old school vibes. Hope I'm not being graded for this. Almost dead. There we go. <laughs> this was actually kind of cool. I hope I'm not graded for this. Oh wow, that's it. It didn't even take 20 minutes. <laughs> All right. The Archfiend threatens the land of Hollow Guard. Yeah, okay. Well, this is actually kind of fun.
So this has been a Divine Dynamo Flame for it by Inti Creates. God, I did not know what to expect coming into this, but it's just old school isometric action adventure vibes. Like old school Zelda, old school uh, East. I'm even reminded of like Crosscode in a couple ways. But this is like far simpler with a uh, pretty interesting way to tackle boss battles. Like, this is actually really fun. I'm definitely looking forward to the release. I don't know it off the top of my head, but what? I will go take a look on the Steam page. Okay, Divine Dynamo Flame Fred only has a 2024 release window. Wouldn't be surprised if it gets pushed back to 2025, but I'm definitely keeping this on my radar. So with all that being said, uh, that's going to be the end of the video. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Uh, if you liked what you saw, please consider liking, commenting, subscribing, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks. Have fun.